Hey, hey, side jewelry class. How are we going to take jewelry class virtual? Well, you all should have gotten uh, your virtual packets. And um, with that, there is some wax, some tools, some things we can use to uh, continue this class. Um, I feel like actually right now, this time is a, a good time to kind of explore and see what you can do um, from an artistic, sculptural standpoint. Um, even if it's not just jewelry, we're going to stay around there. But um, you know, with extra time, it's a lot to just go outside and, and we're going to have a found object project. We're going to do one where we do some wax carving projects and, and some different modules that I'll post on the Canvas site weekly. Um, but it's a good time to, to really get into some things and, and look at, you know, objects you find around the yard or around your house um, and, uh, and can create into, uh, into jewelry or little tiny sculptures or just create some art. So uh, everything will be posted on the Canvas site. There will be modules. Um, and as soon as I get the content for every module, I'll post them to that Canvas site. You can work ahead. That's fine, whatever you finish. Um, the turn-ins for the assignments and things like that, um, if you want to just take a picture, uh, you can take a picture and email them to me. And from there, we will, uh, you know, I can grade, grade what you've created and, and, uh, and things like that. If you do a wax carving and you really like the carving and you want to get that cast, um, we will, um, we can work through, you know, when can you bring it up to school and I'll, you know, take it from you, you can drop it off in the parking lot, you can't come into the building, but, you know, I could potentially get it cast for you and things like that if it's something that you're really proud of. So we'll kind of all approach this as it happens. Um, everything's kind of a learning experience. We're figuring out as we go. Um, but I've got some ideas. So, uh, you know, look at the Canvas page. Um, come through daily during that class time. I'll be available. You can contact me um, at any point, uh, and I'll have some online lessons and things like that that we'll go through and, and use this time to just kind of finish some projects up and, uh, and get through this semester. Again, I hope everyone's staying safe and, um, and not too bored out there with, with nothing going on. I miss all of you, and uh, I look forward to staying in contact through, uh, through the Canvas page and for the rest of the semester.